What's going on everybody? Rob here aka Trev 2323. Today we're going to be going over filling up with 2020 Bayliner at the Hammond Marina. It's a really windy day today. The wind's coming from the west this way. That means it has the whole lake to flow over. You can see kind of the movement in the boat right here. But I was out here Saturday when it was nice and calm and there was too many weekenders at the boat docks. So I have to come out here this uh today uh during the week is like a tuesday to fill up but we have the lines already or wednesday or tuesday we have the lines already there's a bumper right there and there's another line and you could actually throw the line to the people at the uh at the fuel dock here so the fuel dock at the hammond marina is after you come out the main thoroughfare right before you leave to the lake michigan right there there's a fuel dock a little house over here that we're going to be going to uh don't come in hot around here because sometimes this is really congested with boats but the first one's diesel and then there's regular let's see there's diesel regular and premium so you know me with the smaller engines i prefer to put premium in there uh so we're gonna go in here and hopefully somebody comes out my love can you please get up and get the front rope so we can throw the front rope to somebody and then we'll have the dock pole in hand so there's somebody on the dock already so we're going to premium and then you know i when i personally when i come here i bring cash because i kind of like to tip everybody that really helps me out so uh, we're going to go to the premium station here and then we're going to hand off the rope and they're going to help us tie up and the gas tank and the 2020 baylander is underneath the passenger side cushion so that's where we're, uh we got to put the tank in so here we go now we're we're going in and my wife's going to throw the line to them but the wind is coming from the back so it's, it's we're gonna i'm gonna use the pole probably to grab another cleat when my honey hands them the line you can tell the premium hello we're going for premium yes premium here i can slow it down some more even now we're just actually we're just coasting with the wind so i may have to go backwards to slow it down some more I'm actually just going with the wind now. Yeah. Try to grip that one. I can throw you that one, huh? Yes. Yeah. Alrighty, that'll be so much easier. Thank you so very much. I, I didn't even use a dock pole. I just actually threw the rope. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And they help us tie off right here to wherever they can tie us off at. And on a 2020 Bay Liner, if you can look right under here, there's your fuel tank right there and it says i'm on the quarter tank now i came saturday but it was jam packed i'm shooting a youtube video i youtube a lot all right so here we go this is where your gas tank is oh. you said premium. premium yes please and we're gonna go ahead and fill it up I'm gonna put this one over here. Oh, I wonder if they have. Oh, yeah, you could go in there now. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and fill this up while my honey goes shopping. There is a little shop over here that you could pick up some stuff, some last minute stuff. So let me get the tank and then my honey's gonna go shopping. Premium. Okay, thank you, thank you, thank you. Let me see if I get this. Yeah, the wind just pushed us in. I had the I had it off. Oh, I'm supposed to shut the motor all the way off. I'm sorry. Yeah. Shut the motor off. Yeah. You can't even tell that the sign. Yeah, it's quiet. <laughs> yeah, that's a brand new four stroke. We were looking at getting a bigger boat, but they had to be used and they kept failing the sea trials and all that. So I told my honey, I said, you know what? We're just going to get a smaller boat, but a newer one where we know all the work that was done on it. Yeah. Man, that wind is something else today, huh? <laughs> You're actually my first boat of the day. So really? And actually, we came in here, we waited till today, so the weekenders will be gone. Oh, 
So that's why we waited for today. Monday, oh, that was crazy. Really? Oh. I would not have thought Monday to be crazy. It looks like it's been cold, bro. Okay. Ugh. Oh, Monday, that's when oh, I was holiday. here. That's when I was here, Monday, yes. I'm gonna say, you're gonna love it. You gotta pay attention, bro. Okay, if I put the seat back here. And then I'm gonna give you the cash so you can go in, my love, okay? Okay, and that's how you fill it up. Now she was gonna help us untie it and push it off, but man, this wind is blowing, so we're gonna have to put that motor on to spin it around and go to your. All right, so we got the. What's today's date? Today is uh, Wednesday, September 4th. All right, here's the gas prices right now. Wednesday, September 4th, regular 339, premium 369, diesel 299. What's freaking me out is I thought this was stationary. I don't know how she works here every day, but I am going crazy bouncing around. Now, every day they're open only until 415, 830 to 415 over here at the Hammond Marina. So we got to get this boat untied and look how windy it is today. So the reason why we waited though was because it was Labor Day weekend and it was jam packed. And also right here we have the, I had to put the bumpers out because this side right here was rubbing a little bit too much and my rub rail is above the dock. All right, so away we go. Okay, my rub rail is actually higher than the dock itself. So we winded up having to put the bumpers on that side because with the wind it was hitting back and forth. But I have the motor kind of, I know it's a no wake area, but I got the motor with some pressure because the wind is so hard coming at us it actually kind of tries to pull the boat one way or the other so uh that's one bad thing about us being all the way on the what are we on the western side of lake michigan if we got wind blowing from the west and the southern side if we have wind blowing coming in from the north this is what it is uh, here and people are blaming me ever since i put my boat in the water it rained and the wind shifted well this is why smaller boats can't go out in this weather because the waves generate from on the other side of Michigan and blow all the way over here. Now if the wind's coming from the south, the waves start right here and go that way. Or if the wind's coming from the uh, west, the winds start this way and goes the other way. But uh, in winds like this, that's another reason why I didn't skimp on the motor. Because if you skimp on the motor and you're on a really windy day, it's going to struggle too much. You get a motor that you, the, it's the capacity that the boat takes right here. The, the capacity that the boat takes the max horsepower this boat can take is an 88 horsepower motor so we got a 75 horsepower motor on the back of this now if you get the bigger uh bayliner uh, 18 footer it could take 115 motor and people say well i wish i got that one well i am so glad i got this one because one it is orange and for two it fits right directly inside my garage either way that's fueling up at the hammond marina sorry it got a little sketchy at the end believe it or not use the person and not the dock pole because it was so windy behind us she was just waiting for me to throw her the, the dock line and i was trying to grab onto anything with the dock pole so at this instance somebody was there to help i should have used it all right talk to you later bye bye